Hi, in this video, I will be demonstrating how to install Windows Server 2019. So first of all, let us uh, download this uh, evaluation 180 days uh, ISO file from Windows Microsoft.com. Uh, you can download this uh, 180 day evaluation. Uh, just say continue, you can download this. If you want else like uh, Server 2016, you can download 180 day. Similarly, Server 2012 anything so here I have already downloaded this uh, file uh, let's see this about uh, 2019 is about 5 GB approximately data center edition 64 bit and of course I have also downloaded 2016 also 2012 all of them are evaluation editions okay the minimum uh, requirements to install this uh, server 2019 is uh, about 2 GB of memory, even though it works for 512 MB of RAM, but ideally 2 GB or more RAM is suggested. And a hard space of 32 GB recommended minimum, but uh, suggested is about uh, 40 to 60 GB, anything about and a network card. Okay, let us quickly uh, install on VMware. Okay, here I start this file, new virtual machine, uh, just a typical next and uh, select this ISO so here in this case I'm selecting this uh, 2019 and say next don't give any key leave it uh, you can select this data center core or server standard core okay uh, say next yes and choose the location where you want to place all these files so here I have already created a directory in uh, VM folder if you have not, you can create a folder. So 2019, say OK. Next. And leave this uh, 40, 60 GB is OK. Uh, if you want, you can store in a single file or in a multiple file. Say next. OK, don't go wrong. So there is one small change we need to do. Once you finish this, you should be able to get into the system. So here, uh, what you can do is edit virtual settings. Uh, do a small change. Remove this floppy drive, which you don't really require. And also, a change in the network adapter. Connect to bridged. Say OK. That's all. Now power on the machine. OK. So it should start. You can even maximize the full screen. Okay, so here you can see uh, English United States, time and currency. If you are in a different country, you can select say next and say install now. Okay, uh, select this data center and it with the desktop uh, experience. Say next. Please accept the license terms and say next. Select this custom here. So what you can do is new and the complete this you can select. It will create the partitions automatically with the selected uh, space which you have provided. Okay, say next and the files gets copied. It will take some time. We can restart the system. So once you are done, you please provide with the password. Here I am giving star underscore one two three. Some complex password needs to be given. Finished. Okay. 
from here. So the server is ready. Let us log in. Star underscore one two three. So first time the desktop is set. Okay, so now the desktop is ready. What you can do is uh, okay, the icons are ready. We can verify, we can check the properties. You should see Microsoft Server 2019 data center edition. Okay, now you can even uh, change the name if you want to change the name. We can change the name. Okay. Let's say maybe so this is a name of the computer. It requires a reboot. And we can say restart now. This ends completes our installation. 